As many as 2,000 tri-state workers and their families are breathing easier tonight. The Postal Service's decision to keep the Dalton Street Processing Center open has <laughs> saved their jobs. It was one of almost 250 mail processing centers nationwide slated to close to save about $3 billion a year. Nine News reporter Bill Price is live in Queensgate tonight with reaction to the surprise decision, Bill. Well, Clyde, the bottom line here means that uh, 1,200 full-time postal workers, maybe 800 part-time workers will be able to keep their jobs and their salaries. And many of those workers and the supporters say they feel like they uh, won the lottery today. All right, yeah! <laughs> That's how Cincinnati Mayor Mark Mallory and a passing Postal Service trucker responded tonight to news that 2,000 jobs at the Dalton Street Mail Processing Center have been saved. Postal workers and the union officials were very relieved at the surprise good news. We went in there, we always go in expecting the worst, hoping for the best, and today we heard the best. I'm ecstatic, actually, relieved. Um, you know, couldn't be happier right now. Yeah. Christmas in February. Luthie says that his life and the life of his family would have had to change drastically if the processing center had closed. He's 41 years old and many years from retirement. We would have had to have gone wherever they sent us throughout the country. It could have been anywhere in the country, actually. So the, the prospects of, you know, uprooting the family and everything else, um, you know, weren't good thoughts, actually. And I wasn't looking forward to it. Postal workers aren't talking tonight about why they changed their minds about closing the Dalton Street Center. Union officials say they think a feasibility study showed administrators it was simply too expensive to easily shut down. If you look at the area, it serves 2.2 million people right here in the heart. We've got all these large businesses in the community. Um, they've heard our message loud and clear. I believe that they looked at it and they made they came to a good business decision. The economic impact of 2,000 jobs at the salaries that are paid here uh, would have been devastating to our economy. It would have been a real blow. I mean, 2,000 jobs all at once. That's a lot of spending that happens locally. Now, certainly it also means that uh, even though the uh, Dalton Street Mail Processing Center will remain open, it uh, also indicates that uh, Postal Union uh, chiefs will have a lot of tough negotiations about salaries and benefits to come. That's because the Postal Service still has to find ways to cut billions of dollars in expenses in the coming years. Carol? Bill Price, live for us in Queensgate. Thanks, Bill.